Okay. Oh god, what's that? What on earth is that? Hello, and welcome to another indie horror game. This time, I'll be playing the demo to Echoes of the Living, and if you'd like to do the same, the links in the details are down below in the description for you, alright? So, this is going to be a third-person survival horror game inspired by the classic survival horrors like Silent Hill and Resident Evil. And that means fixed camera angles, tank controls, all that stuff. Looks like a lot of fun. Now, I've heard that the demo is actually quite long. It might take two to three hours to complete, so I probably won't play through the whole thing because I'll probably want to play the full version of this when it gets released. I won't want to spoil myself, but I'll definitely give it a good go, alright? And I hope you enjoy it. If you do, leave this video a like, leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Here we go. This is the demo to Echoes of the Living. Alright, okay, uh, so do we play as Chris, uh, sorry, Liam Oakwood or Laurel Reeves? Seems like they've got different stats. Uh, is that going to affect the gameplay? It might. I think I'm going to play as Laurel Reeves. Yeah. Okay. No cutscene, no introduction. No, we're just straight in, I guess. All right, so... Wow. Uh, welcome to not quite Raccoon City, I guess. There are too many of them. I should run. And uh, thankfully, I know how to do that. Right. This way? Uh, no, maybe not. <laughs> oh, boy, that's not a good start. Uh, around here? Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Oh, let's hope I'm going the right way. Down this alleyway? All right. This is very reminiscent of the uh, the start of Resident Evil 2 and 3, isn't it? Okay, now we're trying to break into the Peacock Pub. And we've done it. Okay. Whew. Are we safe in here? Can I calm down now? Let's hope so. All right. Wow. What a start. Welcome to Echoes of the Living, I guess. So... Whoa. Oh, nuts. They're trying to break in. They're not leaving me alone. So, I know how to run. Uh, I think it's... Yeah, it's Y for the inventory, which looks very Resident Evil-ish, doesn't it? So we got the HP in the top left, some sort of personal item. Uh, three weapon slots, six item slots. I do wonder if maybe Liam can hold more items or weapons, or maybe less. Maybe there's a, a difference there between the characters. Uh, and then, of course, we've got archives. I don't have any archives right now, but I guess this is uh, all the text stuff that I'd find. There's a map. There's a map. Okay. Pretty good one, too. Looks like I've already mapped out the bar. And then we've got the config options. Not bad. All right. Let's see, then. What are we going to find around the bar? A broken sink. Water's dripping. Okay. That doesn't seem terribly important, to be honest. I'm actually hoping to find a couple of items. Maybe a couple of weapons. That'd be nice. Because it looks like I haven't got anything with me. All right. Okay, whiskey. You know what? After what I've just seen, I probably need some. Various types of alcohol bottles. But I'm not in the mood to drink right now. Well, I am. <laughs> and maybe Liam would be. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's stuck. I can use something in green to force it. Let's see if we can find that something in green. A beautiful piano. But I don't want to play because I'm not Rebecca Chambers. Uh, Alright. That's a lot of blood. It's a hell of a lot of blood. Right. I suppose this would be the normal entrance. Uh, it's not safe to wander the streets. You got that right. Looks like there's an item over there on the side, actually. Yeah, I need to find another way out. All right. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Something here? Handgun bullets. Yes, I think I will take them. And then... Have you got something? You do. Oh, that's the gun, isn't it? He's dead. Wait. He's holding something. Something that I definitely want. Alright. Um, so... I suppose I'm going to have to go into the inventory to equip this. Okay. Is that equipped? She's holding a gun. It's equipped. Alright, good stuff. <laughs> Just getting used to everything. Alright. Over here? 
blocked. Fair enough. Um, looks like that staircase is blocked, but the, the other one, I think, was available. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't look blocked. Maybe I should go up. Maybe I'm going to find that something in green up here. I quite like this so far. Controls pretty well. Alright. So, yeah, I'm playing this with a controller. You can use a mouse and keyboard, though, but it does advise a controller. Alright, so, yeah, R3 to get the map straight open. It looks like... It looks like that isn't a window. What is this? Oh! Oh, I see! Oh, we're just moving this out of the way. Oh! Hello. Alright. What have you got there? A combat knife. Okay. Well, I might need that if I run out of ammo. Right. Uh, can I quickly pull that out, or is it the same kind of way as equipping the handgun? Same thing as equipping the handgun, I think. Uh, seems kind of fiddly, but I'm getting the hang of it. Anything else? An antique globe of the Earth. What's that? I have no idea who this guy is. <laughs> I wasn't looking at that. I was looking at the thing to the side, but... Ah, okay, that's, uh, that's not what I thought it was. All right. This way? This is a pretty good looking game, isn't it? So let's see. Um, all right. Looks like there's going to be a little more around here. Oh, this is the area from the, the menu, isn't it? Yeah. There's no signal. Evidently not. Right, okay, so let's try these doors. Let's try this one. Locked from the other side. Okay, alright. This one here. That works. Alright. Oh! Uh, I suppose this would be like a health item? Yeah? Let's see. Uh, it's hard to read text that small, but it says a small box of analgesics restores a small amount of health. Okay, good. Yeah, it's a health item. Looks like a lot of trash is stored here. Oh, hang on. Hey, that's not trash. Handgun bullets. Something here, too. The restroom key. Alright, this game knows me. <laughs> Something in here? No? Uh, Alright. Right, let's get out of here. Okay, so the restroom. That was locked from the other side. What about, what about this one over here? Locked. Okay. Use? Hmm, okay, I guess that's not the restroom. I suppose that would make some sense. This is all of us. Whoa! The staff area. Holy crap, that made me jump. Ah, oh, they finally got in. It's okay, it's okay, I've got some ammo. I like his coffee t shirt. Oh, wow. Yeah, remind me never to go outside. Oh, even he's waking up now. Okay, well, let's get introduced to the combat, I suppose. It looks like we're going to have to go downstairs. Are they going to come up? Uh, no sign of them as of yet. Right, they might come bursting through that door, I'm not sure. Right. Oh, hello, hello! Okay. Took quite a few bullets to go down. What was that, like six or seven? Oh, and there's this guy. Thanks for the gun! So, yeah, we can aim down, we can aim up. Maybe we can get some, like, good headshots. I think I'm gonna need to be a little bit closer, though. I'd rather not risk it. At least, not right now. Okay. Right, thankfully the arms aren't coming through. We can't loot the bodies or anything? No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay, alright. Um... Not when they disappear. <laughs> Over here? This might be the restroom. That would make sense. Yes, okay. And the key's no longer useful. So, oh boy. I think that means I got rid of it. Oh, what's that? There's a blue item down there. That. Oh, that's showing that her neck's been ripped. I'm actually more curious about what this is, though. A manager key. Ah, all right, okay. More health? Yeah, more health. Okay. 
We got anything in the stalls here? Uh, don't think so. Uh, uh, Alright, in here. James was here? Is that a drawing of Pyramid Head I see? No way I'm touching that. Only a maniac would be so stupid. <laughs> nice little reference. Okay, alright. I'm enjoying this so far, actually. This is uh, fairly well polished. Right. So, maybe that door that I tried to begin with, with the key, that's where I need to use the manager's key. That's what I'm thinking. So, that's through here. And then, at the end, yeah? Right, yeah, I don't think we do it automatically. We've got to go in here. We've got to do it like that. Alright, something down here? Handgun bullets? Alright, yes. 30 rounds! Ooh! Is that someone trying to get... Oh, someone trying to get through the door? Oh, and they have! <laughs> right, let's go back here. It's a more, a more favourable camera angle, you know what I mean? Alright. It doesn't seem like there's any lock-on in this game. So, yeah, you've got to make sure that you're aiming in the right location. Ooh. What have you got down here? A metal rod. Oh, that's the something in green, isn't it? That's going to help with the uh, the hatch behind the bar. Alright. Oh. Okay, the Peacock Pub. A sneak peek to the past. Once a private club for aristocrats and rich society, it was built in 1894 by William J. Morton as an art gallery in honour of his wife, Eva Lovegood, one of the most talented painters in the region. During World War II, the Peacock Bar was used as an operations base, since its cellars underneath and access to the sewers granted a safe getaway in case of invasion or airstrike. Since its reopening back in 1985, the new owner, John L. Pendleton, has planned to bring back its old glory days by restoring the gallery and expanding the collection with magnificent and unique pieces from all over the world. Alright. Cool. I'll have to look for more of those. Collection of old books. Nothing of interest. Alright. So it seems like not all the items are, uh, are obvious to see. Oh. Okay. There we are. We got anything over here? Various antiques, nothing of interest. Well, there's got to be something, right? It, it's so dirt that I can't see a thing. <laughs> something down here? Oh, there is. A garnet sapling. Interesting. That looks a lot like a red herb to me. A small curative herb. It won't cause any effect by itself. Right, am I going to have to find a green one? Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. Uh, alright. This was locked from the other side, wasn't it? Not anymore. I can use something to force it. Surely this something has to be this metal rod. There you go, I've used the metal rod. So, this is going to give me access to a, a cellar? Okay. Alright. You absolutely sure you don't want to drink? Nah, I guess not. <laughs> She's not too bothered. Okay, another important item in this dead guy's hand. A locker key. A locker key? Alright. Oh. Well, this doesn't look like a locker, but I suppose I should try. No, still locked. Huh, alright. Um... I saw some lockers upstairs. I didn't see any that were locked, but right, let's go check again. Oh, where, where the hell did you come from? All right. Okay, so hang on. What we got here? Uh, okay, Josh, if you're reading this, get the hell out of here. The freaking manager got crazy and started to bite customers. Bob and I pushed that bastard into the bathroom and locked the door until the police arrived. Gonna go to the hospital for a quick check. This bite wound's looking worse every time I take a look at it. Take care, Sarah. Oh, that's not gonna end well, is it? Alright. Didn't notice that, so maybe I didn't notice a, a locked locker. Wait, that one? Ah, there we go. It had a handprint on it. The maintenance key. Probably for the door in the cellar, right? Alright. Good stuff. I wonder what else I've missed. <laughs> probably quite a lot. Right. 
Okay, let's let's ignore you. I'm gonna go straight for the door. I'll see if I can conserve ammo when I can. All right. I heard some moaning and groaning, but uh, I think it's just coming from upstairs. Let's go down. Okay, still locked, but for how long? Not long at all. All right. So, the maintenance area. Let's see. Something over here? Ne oh. What was that? Oh. Bloody hell. All right. <laughs> and uh, it looks like we're here in sewers or something. Okay. It's firmly sealed, apparently. Right. Do I have a map of this area? I do. I don't know how, but well done. Right. Um, I guess I'm in the top right of the map. Let's see. Oh, God. What happened to you? His face expresses a horrible pain as a spider crawls out of his mouth. That's a nice touch. His entire body is covered in cobwebs. So, spiders. Okay, subway maintenance tunnels this way. That's Spider Central, though, by the looks of it. It's too dense to cross it. There must be a way to remove it. Right. So, what item do I need to remove the cobweb? Something down here, maybe? Sounds like it. Alright. Oh, God. Here we are, wading through sewage. Alright. Yeah, definitely no lock-on. Gotta make sure you're aiming in the right direction. Right, okay. Let's see. Uh, so we're at a bit of a crossroads, I guess, here. So that's a dead end. Oh, hang on. I can see light coming from the other side, but there's no way to cross it. Ah, okay. Nothing here either. No items, no supplies. No, it doesn't look like it. This way. Alright. I'm liking this so far, yeah. Based on my initial first impressions, I think I will be playing the full version of this when it gets released. Alright, hang on, what we got here? It's chained, is it? Hmm, okay. Uh, it looks like there's something back there. I'm definitely going to want that. It's blue, so it probably means it's important. Looks like that's as far as we go, but what about the ladder? Alright. Okay. So, I didn't want to go back outside, did I? Are we outside? I don't know. What's this? An inhalation mask. Oh, okay. After intense research, I found a way to fight back the infection, as long as the host has not been exposed for too long to the fog, or has fully turned into a walking corpse. This unknown disease is spread by air, infecting the host's lungs, then spreading to the rest of the body in a matter of hours. But if an antibiotic is administered directly into the lungs, there's a chance to neutralize the infection before it has a chance to spread. The most efficient antibiotics are medicinal saplings that can be minced and mixed for a single dose using any kind of inhalator. So, Peridot, Garnet, Azurite. Green, red, blue. And to be honest, it looks like they have the same kind of effects as you might expect from Resident Evil. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Um, so... It looks like I've already equipped that. That's my personal item. Right. Would Liam get a different personal item? A warehouse key? Sure, sure. But, uh, yeah. That only leaves me one slot. Let's see then. Right. It seems like we're inside a warehouse. So, okay, what's this? Keycard A? Okay. Alright. No more free slots. This way? Pizza? Uh, oh, hang on. Something over here. Well, yes, I do. But I don't because I can't. The inventory's full. We've got to figure this out. There's use combined. There's no drop, so... Do I use some of this stuff? I, I, surely not. Something down here? Ah, okay. Iron Apex & Co., one of the biggest companies in the city, has been under the radar for quite a long time, since its adjudication of public terrain was approved by the mayor last year. Many questions are still in the air, while the citizens rise the protests against the illegal appropriation of the terrain that was planned to be the placement of the new infant hospital. This is not the first time the mayor has been 
uh, involucrated in these kind of dirty business with big companies. However, elections always seem favourable to him. Uh, the plans of Iron Apex and Co. are yet unknown to the public, but many evidences suggest that the construction of a new factory is already in the works. Many bulldozers and industrial trucks carrying what seem to be containers and engineering equipment have been spotted by multiple witnesses. Only time will reveal what plans Iron Apex and Co. have for our city. Are they like the Umbrella Corporation in this game? Maybe. Right. Through here? Locked. Um, let's see. Not anymore. Okay. No longer useful. Right. Right. I really don't want to go outside. <laughs> let's go back in and let's see if there's anything else that the warehouse has to offer. Uh, well, you know what? Actually, now, now I can pick up that floppy disk, can't I? So let's see. Using this on a computer will allow me to save my progress. Oh, I see. So this is kind of like finding an ink ribbon or something like that. Okay. Over here. Locked with a simple lock. Okay. Can it be unlocked with a simple kick? Guess not. Guess I'm not going through there. It's too dark outside, but I can see an alley on the other side. Alright. Here. Locked from the other side. Okay. Up and around the walkway. What about this? Okay, this works. No sign of zombies as of yet. Something down here, though. Gun... Okay, gunpowder as well. Wow, there's uh, there's definitely a lot of Resident Evil influence in this. Um, so it looks like I can make 9mm bullets, shotgun rounds, refined gunpowder, magnum rounds, explosive rounds. Very nice. Okay. Is that... That's gunpowder, it seems. Right, okay. I want to take that, to be honest, but I, I just can't. So... Ah, oh, right. Sure, why not? Let's use the floppy disk. There you go. That may have been a bit of a waste, I'm not sure, but there you go. Laurel, warehouse, office, save, number one. So, the gunpowder. Yeah. Uh, I think to make 9mm ammo, I'm going to need two of these. And I don't even know if I can pick up another one to do that, so that's going to be awkward. We've got another door here. Okay. Right, there you go. Look, more, more gunpowder. That I can't take. Time heals nothing, it says there. Okay. Wait, what's... Oh! Ah, we do have a storage box. Okay, that's good. That's good. Um... So, let's see. I don't... I don't necessarily need all of that, do I? Uh, the keycard, I'll keep that on me, just in case. The gunpowder... Well, let's, let's pick up the remaining gunpowder, shall we? There you go. So... Combine... Brilliant, okay. And that spare gunpowder, I think what I'm going to do is just place it in the box. Yeah. Okay. And then it's LB and RB to go back and forth. Got ya, alright. Anything else? Uh, it doesn't seem like it, does it? All the lockers are empty, unfortunately. Right, let's get out of here. Well, that's cool. Right, so it looks like the only move is to go outside. So, uh, yeah, wish me luck, because it looks like a hellscape out there. Okay. Let's see, let's go towards the camera. Alright. Is that something? Oh, it is! Ah, right, okay, so that's a Peridot sapling. That's a green herb, essentially, right? Yeah, restores a small amount of health. Good stuff. Bad stuff. Very bad stuff. Right. Uh, is it worth killing these guys? I don't even know. Oh boy, right. It seems like you can't reload when you're aiming. You can only reload when you put the gun down to your side. Oh boy. Ooh. How many rounds have I got left? Mm, okay, quite a few, quite a few. Alright. Stop them. 
The shutter's down. Is there something over here? There's a hole with a square-like shape. Okay. We're going to look for a, a square-like item, I suppose. Oh, he's got bullets. Brilliant. Okay. Didn't see those. Nothing down here. Just lots of trash. Yep, yeah, okay. <laughs> the huge barricade's blocking the path. Right, so have I mapped this place out like everywhere else? I have. I think I'm in the top right. So there is something beyond that shutter. But nothing up the stairs. I think we've got to go around the block. Yeah, around this building here. So there's nothing here? Nah, just a blockage. Okay. I might be able to run around some of these zombies, but you probably not. This looks a little bit too thin. Okay. Can I use the bike? I cannot, no. <laughs> uh, around here? Mm, same kind of thing. I think I'm going to need to get through you, not around you. Okay. Thankfully, it seems when they're down, they're down. They don't come back. What's this? Oh, yes. A lockpick for a simple lock, I assume. Let's see. So that was that was back inside, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, come on, guys. Where the hell did you come from? Oh, boy. All right. Come on. Come get me. I'm ready for you. I've got plenty of ammo. We got two of them? Three? No, just two, I think. Oh, boy. All right. And that guy still hasn't woken up. Just a matter of time, though, isn't it, really? This huge construction truck is blocking the exit. Hmm. Right, so this door here? Yeah, okay. Well, hopefully I can break the simple lock with a lockpick. Okay. Oh, there's a lockpicking minigame. All right. How does this work? Like that, apparently. We just move it left and right and it just figures itself out. <laughs> okay. Iron Apex and Supply Company, there you go. So... Right. Let's see. That would be the blocked door, right? It won't budge. Yeah, something's blocking the other side. We've seen that. Over here? Okay. What we got here? A locked door. Alright. And over here, another door? Not locked. Ooh. That doesn't sound good. I feel like running back to the pub, honestly. What's this? Oh, it's 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 locked electronically. A fuse is missing. Is it really? Is it really? In a horror game? I can't believe it. Oh wow. The fence looks solid enough, but I should stay away just in case. Ah, looks like this guy's dropped something. Is it a fuse? Uh, no, it's actually gunpowder. Huh. So, that key card Oh dear. Is that them breaking through? Oh god, that's them breaking through. Okay. Alright, one bites the dust. What about you? Seven bullets does seem to be the magic number for these guys. But my ammo supply is dwindling, as is my inventory space. Let's see. Everyone is dead, but we can go inside, okay. Welcome to the apartments, I guess. Hmm. Right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to go back and I'm going to dump some stuff off in the storage box. Then we're going to come back and have a look at the apartments. Here we are then, back into the apartments. What have we got? Alright. What about this door here? Locked from the other side. Okay. Nothing in the bin? No? Alright. Looks like there's some stairs. Yeah, let's try this one. Won't budge. Something's blocking it from the other side. 
Yeah, get used to that in this game, I think. Alright. Everything... Oh boy. Right. This way? Oh, it's chained. Ah, oh, just like that door down there. Wait, so... No, no, okay. I think I need to maybe break the chain instead of pick the lock. Oh, hello. Where the hell did you come from, then? One of those doors down there? Hmm. Oh, this is blocked? Yeah, they're blocking the access. If only I could move them out the way, but I can't be asked. <laughs> they're not heavy or anything, I just can't be bothered. Ah, through here? Oh, God. Right. Ah. Uh... Oh, yeah, that was a miss. Combat does feel quite good. I'm curious as to how the shotgun will feel, or the magnum, right? You can get magnum. And there was explosive rounds, so what, like a grenade launcher? There's a teddy bear here. A child must have lived in here. All right. There's a bunny plushie. But that doesn't mean a child must live here. Wow. Wow. That's a lot of blood. Everything is covered in blood. Okay, nothing in the box? No, nope, nothing of interest, all right. <sighs> what am I doing here? Really, what am I doing here? Okay, so it looks like this splits up into two different rooms. Um, let's go in this one first. Okay. The bed is covered in blood. Damn. Do I take the fuse? Yes. Yes, I do. So that's going to go next to that door. And then maybe I can go through. All right. So what's in the other room? Oh, wow. What's this? Do I take Do I take the serum? What's the serum? It restores a really small portion of health, but it cures poison. Right. Okay. Um, Herb-wise, I think I'll need the blue one, the Azurite one for that. And I don't have any of that, so that serum's actually kind of handy. Does that mean I'm going to get poisoned soon? It's full of blood. Do I remove the plug? Yes. Oh, okay. Looks like there's something there. Alright. What is it? A small key. Curious. A small key for what? Hmm... I'll keep that in mind. These aren't locks or anything, are they? No. There's nothing else in the room? No. Okay. There's probably going to be something here, but... Hmm. Yeah, I'll keep it in mind. Maybe it's going to be, you know, something through the door upstairs, but I'm going to need to get through that lock. Or maybe through here. But that's locked from the other side. Right, let's get out of the apartments. Let's go this way, and... Well, actually, can we go this way? Oh? Is that an ambulance? It's blocking the path. It's full of corpses. To be expected. <laughs> oh! Oh, okay, we're, um, we're looking for... We're looking for a combination, by the looks of it. Let's see. Let's get the fuse out of our inventory first. There it is. Oh, it's a it's a proper fuse puzzle, is it? There you go. The lock has been released. Fantastic. And through we go. Right. What's that? A a storage room key. Well, I should have a slot free because I just used that fuse. But uh, yeah, that's it. Anything else? Oh, the padlock password. Okay, it's zero eight two three zero. Right, 08230. That's been filed away, and it looks like there's heavy gunpowder. Alright, that's going to be for, like, shotgun shells and stuff, right? Two heavy gunpowder? I'm going to want that. Hmm, looks like that's it. <sighs> okay, again, I'm going to have to run back to the storage box, it seems. Oh. Oh, hang on. <laughs> okay, down you go. You're sort of dressed like Lara Croft, right? <laughs> so I'm wondering, actually, 
if the small key or the storage room key is going to work here. The storage room key works, and now it's no longer useful. Right. Before we go back to the box, what's in here? No enemies, by the looks of it. There's something, though. Shotgun shells? I mean, I don't have a shotgun yet. Hmm, I'm gonna say no. Looks like there's something down here. Something important. Do I take wires? Well, yes, I suppose so. The wires, I think, are more important. Um... The battery appears to be missing here. Okay. And then we need to wire up the battery, maybe? Uh, yeah. And I'm gonna need to come back with a, a completely new inventory, I think. Okay, let's get back to the box. Alright, here we are again. Two trips back to the box later, we're going to enter the code. So... Oh, with the D-pad? Okay, so 08... I think it was 230, wasn't it? Like that? That appears to be the combination, alright. Let's see then. Oh, is that? Okay, there's another red herb, a garnet sapling here. I'm not going to take that, not yet, because I want to see what's inside. I want to see what we're going to find. Maybe there's going to be more important items. Alright, looks like there's a newspaper. Illegal hazardous waste depot uncovered. Last night, police authorities raided Iron Apex & Co. construction site after receiving evidences of hazardous waste disposal and illegal activities. Photographs and documents prove that the construction site was in fact a secret underground depot to store all kind of health hazardous disposals. Among the documentation provided, multiple money transfers made to the mayor, Klaus Graf Meyer, were found. Four hours later, Mayor Klaus Graf Meyer was put into custody for further interrogation and is expected to be sent to prison within the next 72 hours. This leak has revealed the peak of the iceberg, a huge disease of corruption that runs into the veins of our city. It's our duty to unveil the truth and fight for what is fair for our own good and the common well. Good work, Octavia. Good work. Is there something down here? Alcohol-free beer? Ah, oh, I just thought there might be a couple more health items, to be honest. What's this? Oh, oh, hang on. A convenience store key? That seems important. Yes, I will take that. I'm hoping I can maybe find a battery or something in here as well. Is that it? Is that all we're going to find? Food and drink? Nothing of interest? No. I don't want to eat and drink, I just want to kill zombies. Ah, right, hang on. This might be where I use the key. It is! Okay. Alright. Is this a safe area? The music suggests so. No, no it's not. <laughs> that guy just woke up. Oh boy, alright. Oh, hang on, what's this? A freezer to store cold drinks. I can see something behind it. Okay. What's this? Is this... Oh, okay. Alright, brilliant. Okay, uh, we're in the freezer. Is it safe here? I can see them on the other side, but uh, maybe they don't want to come in. Maybe it's too cold. Oh, more gunpowder? Oh, man, I do. I really do. But... Uh, hmm, let's see, is there anything else back here? More hang... yeah, more handgun bullets. I'll take those. Wait... Chain cutters. Now we're talking. Right. So I saw a chain in the sewer, uh, and I saw one in the apartments as well. So yeah, brilliant. Okay. Heavy gunpowder? Sure. Um, what's this? That's the normal one? Yeah, okay. <sighs> can we find extra inventory slots? Can I find pouches or something? I hope so. Maybe not in the demo, but maybe in the full game. That would be nice. Right. Okay. Oh, there's something back here as well. An empty lighter. I bet I'm going to need that to deal with the cobwebs, right? Oh, man. Oh, right. Wait, there's something down here, too. <laughs> yeah, inventory's full. Blow after this. I don't know, I might need to use them. Okay. Is that one down? Okay, that's one. <laughs> oh, there you go. Are we going to get exploding headshots in this game? I kind of hope so. <sighs> right. Uh, what else have we got? 
something around here? Just a load of blood by the looks of it. Alright. Okay, that appears to be all blocked up. Oh, there's still one more! I might actually see if I can lure him out and run around, because I don't want to waste all this ammo. I'm getting more gunpowder and stuff like that, but I'm going to have to come back, aren't I? Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to come back. Alright, hopefully that was worth it. So, uh, yeah, a little bit of deja vu for me. Again, I'm going to edit this out, but I'm going to run back to the box and I'm going to dump off the gunpowder and come back for the important stuff. Alright. No one else has spawned? Good, good. Okay, so there's a couple of things that I want to pick up here. So, empty lighter. Health item, yep. And uh, there's some gunpowder in the back here as well, right? Heavy gunpowder, good stuff. I need to get my hands on that shotgun. Am I going to have the opportunity to in the demo? I at least want to play until then. Alright, there you go. So I've got the chain cutter, I've got the lockpick, and I've got some bullets. So I suppose next up we want to try the chain cutter in a couple of places, don't we? So let's go back out here, and I suppose let's go back into the sewers, right? Because the first one's going to be down there. Right next to the ladder, too. Alright. Okay. Here we are then. There's definitely something important back there. You automatically use the chain cutter. Great. So, ah, oh, this is the battery, isn't it? Right. Brilliant. But it's not just that. What's this? It requires two key cards to open. I think I've got one. I've got key card A, but I guess there's a key card B as well. What is this mucus stuff all over the place? I guess it's got something to do with that company, right? Okay, um... So that was one of the doors. What about the one in the apartment? Let's go take a look. The one up here, yeah? Yeah, okay, brilliant. And we're through. Alright, looks like this is going to be a fairly big place. I'm going to have to go around room by room. Let's see. More blood. That's not good, is it? What's that? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? I've got a couple of slots free. A wardrobe that's locked. And this one isn't. Looks like someone grabbed clothes in a hurry. Yeah, because they knew what was good for them. Right. I think we're going to have to follow the blood through here. Thankfully, uh, not a full bathtub this time. Through here? Oh. I hear someone. I see someone. There you go. Right, and down you go. Shotgun shells? More shotgun shells, right. Something down here? A flop- oh, a floppy disk, yes! Oh, my inventory's full already! Oh, come on! Can't I have one or two more slots, please? I just came from a game where I had one inventory slot. And, uh, I mean, that was painful. This isn't quite as bad, but it's still pretty bad. Hmm, right, so can I go through here? I can. Ah, oh, looks like we got herbs. Oh, that's that's one of the blue ones, the Azerite saplings. That's gonna help with the, the poison, right? I'm gonna want to take that, but a little bit later on. Lock with a simple Oh hang on, do I I think I've yeah, I do have my lockpick with me. That's good. Alright. So don't really know how this works. I guess there's a certain order that we need to do it in, so it was three, two, one, four, five there. Yeah. Okay. What's this? Oh, I thought that was a puddle. It's a hole in the ground. Well, <laughs> you didn't want to put your hand in the toilet, but you are considering jumping down this deep, dark hole. Of course I'm going to jump down. I'm immediately regretting that decision. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah. This is the stuff, the, the mucus-like stuff that we saw in the sewer, the electrical panel was covered in a sticky mass. Yeah, this mass grows everywhere like some kind of ivy. Uh, okay. 
what we got here. Oh, hang on. What? Oh, boy. Okay, there's something down there, and there's something behind me as well. Oh, God. Wow. Okay, so we're getting different enemies now. Jeez Louise. Right, so did you just, like, come out of a wall or something? Also, what's this? Lady went past this. Chemicals. Obviously, my inventory is full. I'm going to need to come back for uh, for many things. Yeah. Oh. Oh, right. Back at the entrance? Back at the entrance. Okay. <sighs> Here we go again. I'm going back to the box. Alright, so now that I've dealt with that, we're going to go in here and hopefully we're going to use the battery. Over here, right? Okay. Right, I've used the battery, so that's powered up. But what does that power- Oh, I see! Okay, right. Interesting. Wait, what have you got down there? Is that the shotgun? That is the shotgun! There you go! Alright, I was hoping I was going to collect it in the demo. Uh, that's a, that's pretty good timing as well, because to be honest, I'm out of handgun ammo. Yeah, there you go. Let's see. Oh, very nice. What's this? Oh, lighter fuel! Right, yes, of course, of course. Anything else? Lots of toilet paper. Who would store this absurd amount? <laughs> yeah, alright, alright. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Uh, okay. Nice. Very nice. Okay, so I'm going to want to put that into the lighter. Then I suppose we're going to want to go back down into the sewers, aren't we? Oh. Oh boy. Hang on, hang on. Right, well, let's give this a go, shall we? Exploding headshot! I'm in. I'm in. I'm definitely going to be playing the full version of this. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, uh, around here. Okay. Let's go back one more time to the box, right? The empty lighter should be in there with everything else. There's so much in there as well. It's getting to the point where uh, it's actually going off the screen. <laughs> so let's see. Uh, the empty lighter. Yep, yeah, gonna want that. So combine these two. Brilliant. It's a regular lighter, now filled with fuel. Good stuff. Now that I've got the shotgun as well, I want to pick up the shotgun shells. Uh, I made a few out of the heavy gunpowders that I found, so there we go. Pretty well equipped. Uh, I've got one more handgun bullet, but to be honest, I think I'm just going to save the inventory slot and keep that in there. Oh, hello. <laughs> Is it going to be another one? Yes, it is! Oh, man. I could get used to this. Alright. What else have we got around here? Anyone else? I'm just waiting for someone to burst up out of the water. But it hasn't happened yet. Hmm. Alright. Let's see. Okay, so around here to the left. That's it. Okay, so... Oh, what? The, the flame won't be big enough. The flame won't be big enough. Oh, the chemicals, maybe? Make oh, okay, yeah, it might be the chemicals. I was wondering what the point of those were, but uh, now I think I understand. Let's try this again. Take two. So, chemicals. Highly flammable chemicals as well. Right, okay. That makes sense. Now, of course, I need something to set it on fire. Don't worry, I've got you covered. Might want to step back. Yeah. You're lucky you didn't set fire to yourself, honestly. But there you go. No more cobwebs. Now it's just spiders. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Right. Uh, okay. What we got here? Oh. Oh, my God. Okay. Jesus Christ. Right. This way? All right. Okay. Good stuff. Uh, we're back out on the streets, though. Whereabouts is this? Uh, Alright, we're in uh, Uptown now, it seems. So, this... Oh, nope, not this way. Nope. 
<laughs> this way? This way works, thankfully. Alright. Oh, man. Can I just wait here and, you know, the problem's gonna deal with itself? Doesn't seem like it, does it? Okay, there's one. And there's number two. Again, thankfully, I'm not setting fire to myself. Okay, what's going on here? It's a fire hydrant. If I had a fire hose... Right, for this... Yeah, the fire is blocking the entrance. I need to extinguish it first. The entrance to what? I don't know. I think we'll be going off map. Looks like there's a room back here, though. Let's see. Oh. Alright. What's this? Oh, wait. Somewhere else to save. Okay. Oh, and is that? That's another storage box, isn't it? It is! Oh, finally, I found another one! Oh, goodness gracious me. I got a little bit bored of running back to that warehouse every single time. Uh, wait, what did I just store? The lockpick? No, I want that. I definitely want that. Okay, the valve? Sure. What's that for? It's, uh, it's a hexagonal shape. Right, so it's not going to fit next to that shutter that we saw earlier. First aid kit? Alright. So what does that do? It treats any wound, restores the health completely. Even takes care of poison, presumably. Good stuff. Okay. So, at the moment, I think I'm going to put these two away. Yeah. Alright, anything else? I don't think so. Somewhere else to save, but I'd rather not waste my floppy disk right now. I want to keep on playing. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. Alright, so let's see. Okay, the knob's broken. Over here. Alright, this works. And this takes us through to the right area, uh, where it looks like there's another set of stairs and a, a few more doors. Let's see. Oh boy, right. Okay, oh, there is lock on, it seems. Alright. Going for the headshots. It, it just makes sense, you know? That guy was wearing armor as well. He wasn't. Doesn't matter, does it? Okay, something over here? A door that won't budge. Okay. And I guess none of this will budge either, will it? No. Alright, let's go around here. Okay. Looks like I can't lift this manhole cover, so I, I guess we're not going down into the sewers again. Uh, and I can't even go up these stairs, so I guess there's nothing up there. Anything else? Guess not. Let's go around the corner. There should be a couple of doors. Okay, the knob's broken. Um, Alright, over here? I, I don't have the key. Well, I, I do have a key. It's the park key. Uh, I guess the park isn't this way? Nah, no, guess not. I've got a small key. Maybe the small key opens the... Whoa! That was pretty good. <laughs> yeah, maybe the small key opens the door? Looks like we've got a couple of herbs here. Yeah, oh sorry, saplings. I guess I'll take them. Yeah. If I can. I can, good. This one? Locked from the other side? Okay, so... Huh. Uh, I think we're going to have to go back to the manhole cover. We're going to have to go back to the west and face those three zombies. But let's go dump this stuff off and... Whoa! Oh, boy. Okay, thankfully he doesn't seem to be too bothered with me. Okay, he is bothered with me. Oh, boy. Whoa! Come on, come on, come on! I... Oh! I was bitten there. I think I was bitten. But I'm still fine. Maybe it didn't take. <laughs> Right, let's go dump this stuff off, and yeah, we're going to have to go back out to the streets. Okay, so... Put that away. Uh, the park key? Yeah, you see, I've got so much in storage now that it's going off screen. And the problem is, I can't actually access the bottom part of the storage. So that is a genuine problem that needs to be fixed before the game comes out. I guess I could, you know, combine a few things, use keycard A, for instance, like, I don't know, just use some health items just to free up some slots, but I shouldn't need to do that. Okay. This way? Right. 
Oh, God. oh, there's fucking four of you? Oh, two in one. Two in one. There you go. I love shotguns in games, and this one feels good. The one time I don't go for the headshot, and it doesn't kill them. There you go. What am I playing at? What am I playing at? Okay, uh, still got, yeah, 11 rounds for this thing. Really? Nothing useful inside? I was hoping I was going to find some ammo after, you know, using all that. Something over here, maybe? Uh, yes! Shotgun shells! Brilliant! Seven of them, actually. That's pretty good. Okay, that's stuck. Can we go around here? Is there something in the back? Ah, oh, the trunk's empty. Uh, around here? Okay. Locked with with a simple lock. Do I still have the... I've still got the lockpick with me. I think it's always helpful to take the cutters and the lockpick with you. Okay. Ah, oh, hang on. So it's that one first, then that one. Then that one. Oh, I see. And then it's got to be two and one. There you go. Yeah. Just got to get the combination right. Alright, let's see. Is that another floppy disk? It is. Okay. And I think a couple more herbs as well. Uh, that would that would leave me with no slots, so I'm just going to leave them there. What else have we got? Various types of desserts are displayed here. Looks delicious. Yeah. It's bread. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, now I'm all puzzled. I think that may have been a Silent Hill 3 reference. Yeah. Anything over here? More delicious looking desserts. What a strange shelf. Can I go around the back? No. Weird. Okay, well, you know. I found an extra save. And I found a couple of herbs. Sorry, saplings. What else have we got down here? Oh! Wow! Holy moly, dude. You nearly got me. <laughs> Alright, so through here. I've unlocked it. Uh, Alright, and where are we now? In the commercial district. Wow. This is a big demo, isn't it? But I'm going to have to wrap it up pretty soon, otherwise I'll go through the entire thing. Uh, okay, a couple more herbs down there. Oh, hello. Right, yeah, bypass the armor. Just go for the head. Same with you. All right, let's see, something around here, okay. This is a really good looking game as well, I, I do like the visuals, I, I do like the fire effects, and I do like the sounds and everything, the environments are really, really cool. Okay. My eyes are darting across the screen all the time looking for any other items. You know what I should probably do, just to shake things up. Go back to the handgun. I've been using the shotgun so much, but it's so effective. You can't blame me, right? Right, I'm getting I'm getting noises from, from two areas here. That doesn't sound good. Right. But I can run around you. Yeah, I can run around you. I don't necessarily need to go for the uh for the kill. Alright. What we got here? Handgun bullets, okay. Wait, more? More handgun bullets. 30. Nice. Okay. So, run around. Yep, you can be cheeky. You can be really, really cheeky in this. Hmm. It's blocked. Yeah, okay. There is something on the other side, though. On the map, it looks like it's not blocked. So, I don't know. Maybe I need to find another... Way around, or or just wait. Yeah, I, I think they uh, I think they're coming through. Right, let's see. I'm gonna see if I can lure them over here, and then weasel my way through all three of them. I don't know if it's gonna work though. I really don't know if it's gonna work. Okay, this guy, this guy, I can probably do. There we go. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> oh, no! Okay. You know what? You can be cheeky, but you can also get yourself killed. 
Oh bloody hell! I'm I'm actually holding my stomach now. I'm I'm hurt. That was that was silly. I shouldn't have done that. I definitely shouldn't have done that. What's that? Is that? Yeah, sure, sure. Gunpowder. That won't move. Anything in here? No, nothing useful. Through here? Okay. All right. Something down here. A crank. Ah. Oh. Right. Through here? Oh. Oh! Oh, this is the warehouse, isn't it? Right, okay. <laughs> I know I said I was tired of coming back here, but I actually do want to come back here now. Yeah, good stuff. Alright. So we've got a crank here. I wonder. Let's see. A square-edged crank. Looks like it's been heavily used. I think I know where that needs to go. Right, so uh, from here, where do we want to go? I think I want to go back through this door around here. It's been a while since I've been through this way. But yeah, remember that sort of slot next to the shutter? I think that's where the crank gets used, and I think that was somewhere down here. Here it is. That guy hasn't come to life yet. I'm so surprised. Right. There you go, I've used the crank. All right, so in here, we find... What's this? Oh, a f okay, a fire hose. So we needed to come in here. Oh, look at that! Yes? Oh, but no, not again. Inventory strikes again. Uh, okay. What am I doing with this knife, honestly? <sighs> right, okay. And then there's some more gunpowder down there. Anything else? Oh, what's this? It's still warm. The bed? Yeah, someone's sheltered in here. Hmm. Okay, here we go again. Going back to the box. Alright, here we go. So, yes, I will take the submachine gun. Brilliant, okay. Yeah, that's a, that's a definite improvement over the knife. That also uses 9mm ammo, so... Uh, I don't know, is the handgun kind of pointless right now? Maybe I should bin that, too. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Looks good on you, Laurel. Looks very good on you. All right. Heavy gunpowder. And what's that? Normal? Heavy? No, it's still warm. No, it's the gunpowder that I want. <laughs> it's normal. Okay, fine. I guess I can make myself some more 9 ammo if I wanted. Uh, but right, that fire hose that I previously picked up, that's going to help with the fire, isn't it? And then maybe I need to use the valve as well. Either way, we need to go back. Hello. Oh, okay. That was nice. Ooh, yeah, okay. I don't think that was actually too many rounds, either. This does feel like an improvement to the handgun. Yeah. Right, the way seems clear. So let's go back this way. Alright. Uh, there's a couple of uh, saplings down here that I should probably pick up, but maybe later on. Alright. Around here, past this place. No one's come back to life, no? Good, good. Okay, already with me, I've got the park key and the fire hose. The fire hose obviously gets used here. As I go through the wall. <laughs> All right, so no more fire. That gives me access to the park, presumably. Oh, okay, more saplings. All right, I'll keep that in mind. Oh, hello. Yeah, I'm liking this. Although it's going to go through the ammo very quickly, isn't it? But I've got 65 rounds left. That ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. Right. Okay. Maybe, maybe I should be going back to the shotgun. Hmm. And maybe I don't need to even kill you. There you go. Right, where are we going? Right, this is the park entrance. I've got the key with me. I, I figured I'd probably need it around here somewhere. Oh, something down here. Is that... Okay, I think that's gunpowder, isn't it? Heavy gunpowder. Mm, I'll keep it in mind. I've got quite a few spares. Oh, there's something down here. 
<laughs> a headless zombie. But aside from him, something next to this body. Oh, this is this is key card B. That means that I can now get that box open. Right. Good stuff. Good stuff. So I guess right. Okay. Have I still got the Yeah? No. It's chained up, but this is a chain that we can't break, it seems. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Oh, this is very Resident Evil. And it's also not available in the demo. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> uh, maybe you'd have to, like, you know, move around some emblems or something like that. Sounds about right, doesn't it? Let's continue our journey before she catches up with me. Round. Ooh. Oh, hello. Again, I can be cheeky and run around. It's locked. Maybe this is where I need to use the key. It is. Okay. All right. Park slash cemetery. Yeah. So you can play football here, but be respectful. All right. You've had a head for long enough. <laughs> I love how it's pretty much guaranteed as well. Okay. All right. The camera angle almost got me hurt there. I knew they were close. I just didn't know exactly where. Sounds like there's yet more behind her as well. I'm going to take this person out. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. <laughs> so they've got to be pretty close for you to do that. That's close enough, it seems. Right. Let's see. So... Uh... To my right? Nothing. A blockage. Yeah, fallen tree is blocking the way. What about across from me? Like the bin? Like, yeah, this way? Down here? Alright. Okay. No, not today. What's going on back here? Looks like an improvised grave. There are lots of body bags. And there's also an entrance to the sewers. Yeah, go on. Okay. The park sewers. Different from the other ones. Can I get this open? No, locked from the other side. Let's see then. Okay, this is filled with murky water. I need to remove it first. Uh, how am I going to do that? There's a hole with a hexagonal-like shape. That valve. I'm going to need that valve. Okay, I'll come back later. That's it. That's it. All right. Let's keep the show on the road. Let's keep on going. It's chained. No, it's not. <laughs> there you go. All right. So now I'm on this sort of west side of the park cemetery. Okay. Another head bites the dust. Oh, God. Another one wearing armor, which I'm going to bypass. There you go. I could do this all day. All right. I shouldn't be wasting so much ammo. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Okay, that's not good. Oh, that's... Oh, that's really not good. Okay, I'm going to go past you. Let's see. Okay, this this is definitely the cemetery section, isn't it? Oh, God. All right, so what do we got? Am I meant to get this open? It, oh, there's something on the floor down there. All right, thank God the door is sealed. I don't know. Maybe being in there is better than being out here. Have you seen out here? Because I'm seeing out here, and I'm not liking it. Right. So, this. What is it? it it's a remote controller. Okay. For what? For explosives! Okay. We blowing something up? Kinda hope so. Okay, you're, you're a little bit too far away, so you get to live. For now. Gunpowder? No. I mean, yes, but... <sighs> Let's see. Anything else around here? Uh, there is, actually, but again, it's not available in the demo. Maybe it's got something to do with that statue puzzle. Yeah. Right. Okay, so we are actually going back on ourselves. 
I do have a free slot. I am going to pick up that gunpowder. No, I'm not. I'm going to examine the body. There are special forces corpses all around. Is everybody dead? Yes, everybody's dead. Where is it? There it is. <laughs> I can't quite find the hitbox for some reason. Maybe I only had the one opportunity. Oh, no, there we go. There it is. Right, let's run around you. Okay, and around you. Okay. So, we need to come back to this area with the valve, don't we? Alright. Yep, I will. Because this time I've got the valve. And that's going to go here, right? Or at least I thought so. Yeah, there you go. Did that work? The water is draining. It worked. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, yeah, there's going to be a little bit more down here. Can I jump down? Oh no, I don't need to. I can use the ladder. Okay, right, let's see. It's too dark to see a thing, but I can hear the water running on the other side. Looks like we're going this way. Uh, okay. Just need to move this out of the way. I like the fact that we can move things to the side as well so easily. Yeah, that's cool. So over there, right in the corner. Good stuff. Yeah, there's a lot about this that I do like. Okay. I probably shouldn't, because I have no idea what I'm doing with them, but yes. <laughs> okay. I've got a pack of explosives. And I've also got a remote control for it in the box. But where do I place them? What am I trying to blow up? One of the crypts? The wall in the sewer? I don't know. It's not really giving me any hints. I suppose we just need to get out of here now. Right. Oh! That's enough out of you. <laughs> oh, I love the shotgun. Right. So... Yeah, what do I do with those? Hmm. Well, let's, let's get back to the box. And uh, let's pick up the remote control for it, because I definitely don't want to detonate it standing right next to them, do I? Alright. And around we go. Good stuff. Uh, I'm sorry, what? what? <laughs> okay, we've got a rogue... Oh, we've got a rogue crow. A couple of rogue crows. Oh, no. Oh, this... Okay, this isn't actually that good. Oh, I don't think I've got any health items on me. I wasn't expecting to get, you know, accosted by fucking crows. It's time to go. It's time to go. Okay. What about around here? Are we okay? Maybe not. Goodness gracious me. Right. Um, so yeah. I've got explosives. I've got explosives. I'll tell you what I also have. I'll put these away. I have got two key cards. Yes. I want to know what's in that box. Maybe it's going to be something to do with the explosives. I'm not sure. Let me just heal myself up a little bit. There we are. Yeah. If I go this way, I... Oh, wait, what? A body is now blocking the sewer entrance. Well, that's a whoa! 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 Sorry, doggies. Bloody hell! All right. Since I've picked up the explosives, things have spawned, and now I can't—I I can't take the easy way back down. So, well, I guess I've got to go the long way around. Something's definitely going on with that. I must be heading in the right direction, or at least. I assume so. Okay, oh, more dogs. <sighs> okay. I'm hearing someone. Oh, it's a dog. It's another dog, right. 
I'm gonna sneak around. <laughs> I'm gonna try. Oh, bloody hell. Zigzag! Zigzag! Zigzag actually seems to be working! Oh, goodness! Oh my god! <laughs> I... Okay. I was about to blow your head off, but you're, you're alive, aren't you? Okay. Wait, dot, dot, dot. Can't you see I'm busy, pal? What? Okay. And who are you? Okay. Anyone else? Oh, there is. Oh, no. Okay, right. Yeah, they're not all alive. Right, let's go take care of this guy, and I probably want to go to the box, don't I? Okay. Alright. Another one bites the dust. Right. Can I finally go down into the sewers? Right, there you go. Oh, the waters have drained here as well. Good. Right, so through here. And I suppose use both the keycards. Yeah, keycard B, keycard A. Ooh, look at that. It's a magnum! But I... <laughs> I can't carry more weapons! <laughs> yeah, well, at this point, the handgun is kind of useless, isn't it? So, yeah. Let's go back up to the box one more time, and uh, let's do this again. Here we are, then. Now I've got a free slot, now I can actually pick up the Magnum! Brilliant! Okay. What a lovely selection of weapons I've got! Shotgun, submachine gun, and a Magnum that uses 50 cal rounds. I could probably make some more rounds for that, although maybe I've used most of the heavy gunpowder for my shotgun shells. Right. Um, okay. A solid fence is blocking the path, I still can't go over. I'm wondering if something's changed now that this has been drained, you know? And I wanted to come down here and maybe try the explosives here. No? Probably a good thing that didn't work, actually. Uh, what did it say when I looked at it? I can see light coming from the other side, but there's no way to cross it. And what was back here? There was a... Okay. Oh god, what's that? What on earth is that? Oh, what? Oh, perfect. So I can't go that way. I guess this would be the tyrant of this game. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Right, I'm just running. I am just running. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, I will. I will. Um, I'm going to put away the explosives and the remote controller, and I might actually go collect some health items. Maybe make some magnum ammo. Let's see what I can do. Right. Unfortunately, I didn't have enough gunpowder to make any more magnum ammo because, yeah, I used it all for the shotgun, but yeah, I'm gonna climb down. I'm gonna see if I can kill this thing. I can hear him down here, but where is he? Around the corner? Oh boy. Okay, that's not good. Okay, yeah, I don't wanna get smashed by a rock. Oh boy, all right, here we go. Oh, did, was that a miss? I, I think that means I'm actually out. I'm out, right. So, submachine gun, maybe? Submachine gun. Let's try it. Is he going to come around the corner? Oh, yes, he is. E oh, oh, okay, that hit me. That hit me. I don't know if I can kill this guy. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Let's see. I've got 66 rounds for this thing. I've got quite a few shotgun shells. i got all these health items. I should be alright. Right, yeah. You missed. I didn't. Oh, and for some arbitrary reason, now I can actually go that way. Right, right, okay. Maybe I overprepared. <laughs> it wasn't actually that bad. Uh, but let's see. Let's see. This way? Oh, I can't. I can't go this way. Okay. Fair enough. All right. Um, 
Well, I guess I need to go this way then, don't I? Hmm. It might be... Yeah! It might be that rubble at the very end of the sewers that I need to blow up with the explosives. That's what I'm thinking. Right. Okay. <laughs> Yet again, we're going back to the box. Alright, so round here. Back through where the webs were. Okay. There's this. Right. Yeah. I need something to remove them. I think I've got that something. I do. Oh, come on, really? I don't even get to see the explosion? Instead, I get to see the end of the demo, which I wasn't expecting to get to. But I was enjoying this so much I couldn't put it down. That was the demo to Echoes of the Living, everyone. Thank you very much for watching. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, like or dislike the video, okay? It would be much appreciated. Let me know what you thought about this. I, for one, thought this was pretty fantastic, honestly. A really, really solid game. And yes, I will be playing the full version of this when it comes out in late 2023, it seems. Yeah, I really enjoyed this. Loved the way it looked, the way it sounded. I liked the monsters, I liked the items and the puzzles. Kinda liked the inventory system, although I'm a little bit of a hoarder in games like this. So, yeah, a lot of the demo was me running back to the box to dump stuff off. Uh, hopefully in the full game there is going to be an opportunity to get pouches, you know, increase your inventory slots to 8 or 10 or something like that. Also, as far as the storage goes, hopefully that bug gets fixed so that when you have so many items in there, they don't go off the screen and you can't select them. Aside from that, I can't... I can't really think of any real flaws. Aside from maybe the fact that it's aping Resident Evil maybe a little bit too much, you know? It doesn't seem to be doing anything too new, too different, too unique. It feels like a really good, really solid Resident Evil clone. Just my two cents. But yeah, really enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Alright, okay, uh, so do we play as Chris, uh, sorry, Liam Oakwood? Uh, welcome to not quite Raccoon City, I guess. The restroom key. Alright, this game knows me. <laughs> Would make some sense, this is all of us. Whoa, the staff area, holy crap, that made me jump. James was here? Is that a drawing of Pyramid Head I see? No way I'm touching that. Only a maniac would be so stupid. <laughs> Something over here? No oh, what was that? His face expresses a horrible pain as a spider crawls out of his mouth. That's a nice touch. Something down here, maybe? Sounds like it. Restores a small amount of health. Good stuff. Bad stuff. A fuse is missing. Is it really? Is it really? In a horror game? I can't believe it. Everything... Oh boy. It's full of blood. Do I remove the plug? Yes. Is that an ambulance? It's blocking the path. It's full of corpses. To be expected. <laughs> Can we find extra inventory slots? Can I find pouches or something? I hope so. Oh, my inventory's full already. Oh, come on. Of course I'm gonna jump down. I'm immediately regretting that decision. Oh, wow. <sighs> Here we go again. I'm going back to the box. I've used the battery, so that's powered up. But what does that ha- Oh, I see. Let's give this a go, shall we? Exploding headshot! Might want to step back. So, this- Oh, nope, not this way. Nope. <laughs> I've got a small key. Maybe the small key isn't the- Whoa! But let's go dump this stuff off in- Whoa! Oh, boy. Oh, two in one! It's bread. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, now I'm all puzzled. I think that may have been a Silent Hill 3 reference. Yeah. Oh, look at that! Yes? Oh, but no, not again. Inventory strikes again. Park slash cemetery. Yeah, so you can play football here, but be respectful. All right, thank God the door is sealed. I don't know, maybe being in there is better than being out here. Have you seen out here? Where is it? There it is. No. <laughs> I can't quite find the hitbox for some reason. Uh, I, I'm sorry, what? What? <laughs> A body is now blocking the sewer entrance. 
Oh, that's a bit- Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Zigzag actually seems to be working! Oh, goodness! Oh, my God! <laughs> I- Okay, 